Welcome back to Pearl TV, where we are all local all the time, highlighting everything that's good in South Carolina. We love featuring nonprofits. We love talking about things to do in the area. And today is one of my favorite in the past. I have a lot of memories of this, the Charleston Air Show. We have Michael O'Connor. He's the Director of Air Operations with us today. Welcome. Good to be here. With you. Yeah, absolutely. How many years have you been doing the show? Uh, this is my first air show that we're actually planning. So, okay. but I, I've been going to air shows since my, or for my entire life. Uh, I definitely started out on my dad's shoulders at an air show 30 years ago uh, under the wing of a C-17, and now that's what I do. I fly the C-17, and I get to give back and actually plan an air show so the next generation can come in. No pressure, for no sure. Pre none, not at all. <laughs> well, and thank you for your service, first of all, as Absolutely. well. It's a pleasure. Yeah. Well, tell us about the air show, the theme, and kind of this year is Heroes of Flight. Absolutely, yeah. So Heroes of Flight, we're trying to showcase the legacy that started at Joint Base Charleston over 80 years ago. Uh, so we, all the flying squadron started off flying the C-47 on D-Day. And so it's the 80th anniversary coming up of that. Very We're showcasing cool. the 75th anniversary of the Berlin Airlift. Mm -hmm. So we'll have an aircraft out that commemorates that. That's the uh, spirit of freedom will be out here. And then coming up all the way up to, through our latest event was the Operations Ally Refuge. We evacuated Kabul International Airport. Okay. So we have those aviators are still here. So we're commemorating just the lineage of, of aviators in, in flight that we've that have all come through Charleston. So, so interesting. Absolutely. And then from, I didn't really realize, but you have, you called them static and then performing. Can you tell me the difference? Absolutely. Yeah. So static aircraft are ones that you can walk around, take pictures, go inside of them. Yeah. So there'll be, <laughs> there'll be events too. There'll be face painting. There's going to be things that, and it shows off the camouflage that we get to do in the military. So a lot of things that look like arts and crafts that are actually tactical advantages to us. Awesome. We're, we get to showcase to the community, all the things that actually happen inside the fences of Joint Base Charleston. Absolutely. So the static aircraft, we have everything from vintage warbirds from 1930s all the way up to fifth gen fighters that were built not that long ago. So we have those. And then on the performer side, we have uh, the C-17, which is obviously we're Moose Town, USA. So we've got yeah. to host our hometown aircraft. Um, all the way up to the Thunderbirds are coming into town to put on a good show. Very exciting. Yeah. Um, tell me what day is it? When is this happening? So we have uh, sort of two events going on. On Friday, we have our Military Appreciation and Family Day. Okay. So if you have a DOD or an ID that you can get on base with on Friday, it'll be for uh, for those members. It'll also be that day a lot of Charleston local schools are bringing out about 6,000 students to do oh a STEM gosh. event. Wow, okay. Uh, so that's going to be... The base will be packed on Friday with those people. And then on Saturday, Sunday, everybody's welcome to come. Uh, and that starts at 9 a.m. on Saturday, 9 a.m. on Sunday. And then okay. the planes start flying at noon. Noon and then over by four, over I by understand. Four, okay. Will there be any food at the event? Can people come hungry? Absolutely, yeah. So we have a local concessionaire. There'll be hot dogs, everything that you can imagine, plus some local food trucks uh, split in there as well. And I love the price. Tell me about the price. It is absolutely free. We're trying to get everybody on base. Uh, it is an event that we want to welcome you in. We make a lot of noise all the time. So this is our opportunity to say, hey, let's show you what we're doing and come on base for free. Excellent. So free entry as well as free parking. Parking is limited, so definitely plan ahead for that. And what I love too is that it's, it's all ages, right? It's for the whole family. Absolutely, yeah. So as far as the parking goes too, we do ask that people register for a parking pass. So that's on our website. It's a free parking pass, but it's airshowcharleston.com. And okay. then we'll you just that. log in, you just print it out, put it on your dash, uh, and then pack that car as full as you can get it. Bring your neighbors, friends, everybody. Carpool. Absolutely. That's our <laughs> biggest encouragement is if you have an empty seat, find a, a friend that wants to go to the air show. All right. And Michael, what is your, what are you most excited about? What performance? Ooh, or that is a plane. tough one. I'm yeah. excited about Doc. He's the B-29. It's one of only two in the world that are flying. Okay. And we have it. At, we're, we're lucky enough to have it at the Charleston Air Show. Very, very cool. So come out April 20th and 21st. Doors open at 9. Show starts at noon to 4. Really, we wish you the best of luck on your first air show. I know it'll be a huge success. And thank you for doing this for the community. Absolutely. We're excited to have you guys here at the air show. All right. So